But if, you know, my, my point stands. I've been knocked out of limits so many times that I, I don't think anything has been good anymore. Yeah, true. All right, so we got the run back. Inland Empire running wins in that fight right now. Man. That's that's what they do. This is this is their tournament. Yeah. This is their event. They always they come, come out. out. They come out strong and come out swinging. Who? Because who won last week? I think it was Cyro, who's also from from IE. Yeah. One wins and I fight. Dang man, even when when I when the when the usual squad doesn't show up, Cyro's like, yo man. Oh, I think Cyro's number two. He is. He is. But like that was essentially his breakout tournament too. He like he beat. Dude, last Wednesday night fight was stacked too because there was like Charlie and a bunch of other people that came. Like, what's up? I lost layers. Oh man, this is Wednesday night fights. You lose, you've gone to back to the shadows. You might, you might have gone to the bathroom maybe. Stop the battle. Baltimore, I mean, worst case, you could just pay for money. You want me to DM him, Bobby? Huh? I can DM him. Alright, Grand Finals. You see, I'm hit starting off with Olimar. Now, when these two played in Winner's Finals, uh, I'm hit actually started with Wolf Game 1, hoping to, you know, have the, the better matchup. But his Olimar actually proved better uh, to be a better pick and he's more comfortable in my experience with it. As you can see, the, the damage is racking up. And that's a, in part Nitro's fault as uh, he does not really make getting the Pikmin that are left onto him a priority to, to get off. And as you can see, he just like racked up a ton of damage. But keeping up with the damage now with I'm in a recovery position. Oh, he almost got that. That would have been so sick. It looks like I'm hit. Know that the wolf didn't do too hot the first set, and then he didn't lose a single game with all of them. So, yeah, so why not just start strong? It's a, uh, it's late. It's a. Uh, looks like I'm hip wants to do go for a 3-0 if, if he can. Get straight to the business. And I, that's something I can definitely respect. Oh, almost connecting the two. So the cross actually uh, interrupted Nitro because it knocked on hip in the correct direction. But he was able to clean up the stock with an up tilt. Parry into an S match with the purple Pikmin. Of course, not the greatest. Oh, snipe him with the purple Pikmin as well. Right now, I'm hip. In a pretty decent deficit here. Ooh, and here comes Nitro. He's racking up more percent. Wow, that almost killed. Rage Belmont, no joke. It actually kind of reminds me of like the Smash 4 Rage, just how strong. Uh, because they have the, you know, the extended projectiles with like a right. bit of width. So they're able to hit back and further out. Ledge trapping coming out from Nitro is so, so good. I like how he sets up the uh, Holy Water onto the platform as well. So that up throw definitely going to do the trick here for I'm Hip. 115%. Now, Olimar is an explosive character, so wrecking a high amount of damage in a, in a low amount of time is uh, very easy for this character. Not gonna kill. Oh, but this is big damage. I'm surprised he didn't go for another up there. Maybe he just wanted to end it off with the get the safe positioning. But nonetheless, I'm hit doing such a great job. Already pretty much 77% off that one. Oh, this should be it. The tip or up snap. Man, where'd he go in that situation? Honestly, like, we, see, we saw I'm hip trying to SDI up, but he didn't get tipped. I mean, there was no way. Getting caught in that fire, just, he was done. The deal was sealed. And right now, Nitro up, and I, I wonder if we do see a game one victory for Nitro. Is I'm hip gonna stay Olimar? I think he will. Just with the, uh, I mean, uh, Nitro has been playing for, for a little bit now. He's a little bit more warmed up. Adjusted. I'm hip, uh, sitting in grand finals for at least an hour. Uh, definitely ice. <laughs> and this this top platform, every time I'm hip goes to reset on it, Nitro's there with a forward air or a back air. Look at that's, that. That's why every I'm saying, single like, time. Why, why do people let Nitro start on game one on this stage? Like, okay, yes, you don't want to start Triplats because Belmont and Triplats, 
you know, they'll they'll pitch a tent underneath those platforms and stay there until they are evicted. Yep. Um, but just with the way that Nitro has been able to trap on those ledges and the platform, like pretty much similar similar timing as well. So game one going to Nitro. Players back getting his prize money, well deserved. Mm -hmm. Third at win time fights is no joke. Yeah, especially with how stacked it was. Three, two, one, go! Okay, now we have game two. I hit on Smashville. Okay, it's gonna be a, a lot smaller stage here. So it, it gives less room for Nitro to work with. And I'm hip is kind of like the aggressor in this matchup because Belmont's kind of like, their setup game is a little stronger. The setup game's a little bit stronger, but once I'm hip able to connect the hit, he's pretty much going to be able to go ham. Yeah, go ham, go in time. Oh, sorry, the white as well. Ooh, that's a jump. No, it's not. Really good stuff, and for the most part, we don't see Nitro like panic jumping, and that's one thing that will get a lot of Belmont players killed. Um, just like, oh, I'm off stage, like jump, 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 and then go to side. Yeah, I mean, in in Smash Ultimate, jump uh, is a huge resource to have, but when you have a horrible recovery, it just becomes that much more important. It's your only resource, <laughs> essentially. Yeah. Okay, purple on deck here. Okay, do you see that interaction between the holy water and the Pikmin? Yeah. So it hit the Pikmin, they both bounced up, and then the Holy Water hit the Pikmin again until it exploded. But it was exploding on the blue Pikmin, which is um, not immune to it, but just, you know, like it didn't die. Yeah. Beautiful carry into the purple border there. Now, I'm getting a little warmed up. Four throw. Okay, yeah, I don't think four throw would have killed so. Nitro going for that down throw. Okay, rolls past the uh, holy water, but gets hit by the F tilt, but not like the tipper F tilt, so it's not too big of a deal, honestly. He hasn't made it back to stage yet. Oh, there's the purple throw. And gonna get. Whoa, did you see that blue F smash that was, like, was on the platform? Yeah, that was crazy. That was. Yo, wait a minute. Okay, great act, but. Yo, actually, that was kind of weird. Right? Yeah, it might have just been like Tech? the, the Yo, throw animation. All in yeah. Yo, dude, F smash like on a platform where you're not on a platform? That I don't know. Be, I, I that could be broken. I could be tripping. Um, if someone from the chat can like clip it. That might have just been like the uh, the throw animation. Yeah, that could be. Side DM. Yeah, sorry, guys. It's late, man. <laughs> Okay, pulling the Pikmin, flashing the white one. Oh, man, Nitro does not care. No, he does not prioritize getting the, the Pikmin that are latched onto him off. I got the white Pikmin on me. We fighting. We scrapping. <laughs> I mean, I mean, at this point, he's like at 130. He just kind of doesn't have to care. But even at lower percent. Yo, dang. He almost calmed that into the axe. That would have been nice. That would have been nice. Okay. The axe, the cross. Oh, tried to get him with the classic. You can see, like, Nitro had just fully committed to the flow oh, chart. Oh, yeah, yeah. He was just like, you're getting hit by this for <laughs> sure. I don't know where you're going, but I'm F smashing. If you get hit, it's your fault. Yep. I have really good stuff avoiding that setup. Now, in the lead here, game number two is grand finals. Really good stuff from my mid because there is a window where like the holy water is wearing out and he can't not can't throw another holy water. So we saw I'm hit get up at that specific timing and yeah, it's a really good job. But he continues to commit to uh, neutral get up or roll. Oh, he can definitely the, get messed. Yeah, you can get scouted. He just one good act. Oh, uh, miss space the F tilt. Yeah, I mean, that still hitting would have been enough to go. But, okay, there's the border. Flying a little too high there. I'm hit. Nice, we're going to keep that in check. Oh, good parry. But it doesn't matter. If the range is too far. And Nitro is taking so much damage from that white victim. Yeah, white and yellow doing a good job. Of, uh, wrecking up damage to their master. Okay. There's Wow, off stage though. Man, that that down <laughs> See that second part, like off stage is so ballsy. Yeah, especially after we saw like 
Nitro pay for it earlier, oh, earlier yeah. in the night? Oh, wait a minute, Nitro mounting this comeback though. Both players have one stock apiece. Oh, tried, tried to get him with the holy water force. I don't know if uh, I don't know if I'm hit's gonna get hit by that. Man. I feel like he's too experienced, but it definitely can happen. Up so there is gonna do it, and I, I feel like Nitro kind of like betting it all almost. Cause I feel like he, he, he definitely does that. Yeah, that but is in his kit to bet it all. Yeah, I just feel like you in that in those situations you have a lot of safe stuff. You go to throw out and bring it back like. Yes. You have the advantage in that long range. You don't have to play like, I'm betting it on this read, I'm betting it on this read, you know what I mean? But, you know, sometimes you're feeling yourself, sometimes you want the, you want the read, so you definitely can't knock on that, but it looks like oh. I'm hip. Oh, wait a minute. I don't think it was a change. Hold on, hold on. We're gonna see a better a better view of the character. No, and no, just he just has like one of those wallet chains. Yeah. That kind of hangs not out as, on the side. It's not as edgy as I thought he was. I don't know, that's kind of edgy. That's definitely some Hot Topic stuff right there. Yeah, but it's not like, it's definitely nowhere near like, I have a chain in the play. Like, that's like, crazy. Like, I, like I don't a know, biker chain? <laughs> yeah, like a biker chain around your waist? That's like, ultra edgy, dude. <laughs> well, the what? edge can live on in your heart. Name me a belt that's edgier than that. That is the edgiest belt you can have. Uh, a belt of bone. I mean, it's not functional. Like, you just said anything. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I, I, I guess. Oh, I, I down like smash. Oh. oh. <laughs> Boss. Yeah, and I mean, I'm hip just utilizing more care mobility. Wow, another. Yeah. And it's, it's scary, too, because if, if he misses any of these, like, Donner, man. Wolf smash that coming in. The reflector on the axe is going to be really good. You can like shield break them for free. And does he have his jump? No, he didn't use his second jump to try and recover high, then commit his going low. Uh, but then had to use his directional air dodge to stop the momentum and try and get him a little bit closer back to stage. And they just, he had no resources, so he was not making it back. Yeah, Wolf Nair is also a really good two off stage against the character like Oh my god. <laughs> oh, okay, still had his jump. Alright. I was gonna say, if, he, if, if Nitro's losing stocks to Ento at the ledge, then this matchup is like way worse than I thought. <laughs> oh man, right now, like, he got like 50 damage off of just nearing him on the ledge. Okay, for another up B, but still, that move uh, is a great tool, but not exactly a good kill option. Yeah, yeah it's uh, it's his quickest option, like his quickest blocking option. Oh, oh that was sick! Yeah, that was a really nice combo. Okay, I'm gonna get the landing on it with the jabs here, and I'm hit up and no. well, okay, we should do it. Yeah, I was surprised that he didn't, you know, throw out an F tilt or or a down smash. But hey, be able to use confirm into a kill throw. I'm hit is totally easy in the kill throw. The desperation is sunk in. We are seeing the dash attack. <laughs> Oh, he doesn't have a jump. Oh, he, he have did have a jump. jump, but it doesn't matter. <laughs> and there is that meaty nair we were talking about. Three stocked by Paul. Yeah. Oh, we a lot of magic, doesn't it? Yeah, Wolf definitely. Yeah, he, he's got that belt with like the little metal dots in it. Definitely some hot topic stuff. Hot topic is going on. Yeah. Bye, Kathy. I mean, he, he had some time away from, you know, the Star Fox universe. It was in the Star Fox game for quite a while, so he definitely hit up your local Hot Topic. Any good Star Fox game, anyway. <laughs> Looks like he's got like a belt buckle too. Like he's got a he belt. He does have a belt buckle. He's like got a belt on his jacket that's like not being used for anything. And then on top of that, he looks like he has a belt like on his actual pants. I'm pretty sure like one of them is just the holster for his gun. Oh, when does Bird Rebel for his flasher? Probably, yeah. Because. I think. With how good that blaster is, it has to be heavy. It's got. Yeah, it's gotta have some to it. It's gotta have a special place, too. <laughs> gotta have a whole stick for that blaster. It's a uh, pretty darn good tool. Okay, down smash. And it's not gonna connect, but even for sense for both of our players. I'm seeing a lot more reflector coming out from my mid, too, which is. Like right there, like ledge jump from reflector would have been so good. Because you just reflect both balls. Reflect off back. Oh dang, the sus the eye! On the back air, Nitro will take that to the bank. Already doing a lot better than that last game, taking that stock. Mm -hmm. You could say like he's doing infinitely better. Oh yeah. 
See right there, after the directional air dodge and then like the double jump drift, pretty much I'm able to have to place that in there. No other option. I like the drag down. Or just the fastball in there from Nitro after he got comboed because he did lose his jump. So if uh, I'm hit was able to convert into an up tilt, it would have been big damage. Oh yeah. Okay, catch that one. Dash tag into or down throw into the dash tag. Great damage here, and I'm hit, man. Sledge trapping with Wolf. So good. Another forward tilt or forward throw. Taking I'm Nitro to 82% just by glitch trapping him. Yeah, and I mean that's in my opinion that's one of Wolf's like best strengths. His glitch trapping is so good. Oh wow, no forward smash. Oh, okay, yeah. might not have been as confident as uh, you know I hit hasn't been getting hit by these forward fires with glitch. Oh yeah. Sure. I'm hit still living whole so close to getting hit by that axe. But the forward tilt center stage. Is gonna work at 170%. You're gonna see a lot of that stock. But the back air, that was a sweet spot too, it looked like. Yeah, he went really deep trying to end that stock. But Nitro able to make it back to stage. Another nair landing for I'm Hip. Now we're gonna see a back throw. Yeah, get him off stage here. Look for this meeting there. Nope, he's gonna stay on stage here. Off for his ledge trap. Next up, the dash tag coming him off. Oh. Like right into that uh, cross. Mm -hmm. Only took 8% for it too. I feel like getting hit by that cross wasn't too bad because it actually like put him back into a room where he can act. Oh, the throw. Oh, wow. That, that tilt went right onto the edge. I don't know if uh, Nitro planned that, but very good there. Man, and I'm just trying to get off this ledge situation right now. Yeah, it seems like the tables have turned when it comes to the ledge trapping game. Now I'm just continuing to take damage. Blasting. Let's go for the runoff in here. I'm hit. Keeping it safe. Four tilt. Oh, this back throw. Okay. Yeah, I mean, it, it's callous, so it probably won't be right. Oh, you just have to get the roll behind back throw. It's funny because I think it's. Okay, Ooh. catches the holy water and the dash tag. Yeah, hold that for a little bit so he can't throw it at you. Throw it, use it right back against him. Not bad. Not bad. Tried to convert off of it, but. Not I mean, it, it serves its purpose because uh, Nitro did try and throw holy water while I think was throwing it. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, good jump away. A B, good damage, but not gonna take the stock quite yet. Oh, but that tipper for there angled upward as well. We got a game five situation here. Right. I'm hip, not happy about that. And now the question is. Will we see another game with Wolf, or does I'm Hip commit to Olimar? I mean, he, was, he was winning with Olimar, right? Uh, he won a game with Olimar, and then he won a game with Wolf. And then he lost the game with Olimar. He lost uh, the first game, all right. Yeah. And then he lost the first game with Wolf. So. Now back to Olimar. Yep, back to Olimar. We're warmed up, we're ready to go. And another thing, we have his counter pick. So he gets right. to play on the stage he wants. Looks like Smashville is the pick. I believe this is the stage we saw him win on. Uh, yes, you're right, because both games that Nitro won on were Kalos. Huh. That's like a trending thing. Yeah. Don't take <laughs> Nitro to Kalos? Huh. <laughs> They're landing there. Nitro is in the field. Get the extra damage from the cross as well. Set up the axe. Holy fire. Just setting up that shot. Yeah. Right now, Nitro has all the control. He down tilts off stage. Now, tables have turned. Ooh, okay, trying to down tilt, but getting planked. Okay, delays the reel in. I'm trying to go for that down air. That's the cross, but the red pigment is ticking. Only water is out. It did clash with the pigment. Now, Nitro finds himself on stage again. Oh, he tried to snipe him with the purple Pikmin, but the upbeat hitbox does save Nitro. Forward smash, yes, and the holy fire confirmed. Does pull through here for Nitro. He even has enough time to, like, dash back and do it, yeah. to make sure that the sweet spot was in his neck. Yeah, and I, I feel like that's the main thing, because I, I when you when you commit to it too early, you're just, it, it can, He's not next. Oh wow, what a deep order from my hip. But in that time, he threw the holy fire or holy water and dashed back to see. Oh, I got the hit. Cool. Then he next match. 
it almost is like allowed him to, to set up correctly. But oh, the white pick oh is on him. Lord. So much damage. I mean, a couple of the ticks were burned off from his ability. Still, man. Oh, oh wait, no Pikmin. So got him and the red Pikmin fighting through. All right. Oh, dang. He's going to solo red. Forward throw. Has not had an opportunity to get more Pikmin. Okay, there it is. The squad coming through. That's the OG squad. This is the squad you get when you spawn in. Yep, there it is. Just waiting for that double jump. He knows that Nitro is trying to line up that forward air tether. So he's just waiting underneath. And then once you see him go for it, double jump, bam. Yeah, he, he's even positioned himself uh, with the first stock that. Ooh, good F man. Bringing it to one stock apiece. Will I'm hit be able to close it out and win Wednesday Night Fights? Or are we going to see a bracket reset? I mean, yeah, anything goes at this point. Oh, wait a minute. Okay, I'm hit. Great. But this, I mean, we talk about it time and time again, the, the ledge trap is coming out from Belmont. And that's going to be mostly any setup characters, right? Like, they're just going to be strong. You have all these tools that you can preemptively set up while your opponent is getting to the ledge. And then it just covers multiple options. It would be very hard and very frustrating to deal with. Right now, going hit for hit, very even uh, game five right now. Both players on their last stock. That's right. And opting to actually use the Nair to get the white pick up. We didn't see Nitro do that at, very much at all today. Yeah. Maybe Belmont just don't have a lot of great moves to get them off. I mean, if you think about it, a lot of Belmont's moves are like just whipping around him. You know what I mean? Outside of the Nair. I think you can down air pick him. I, that I don't that, know. That depends on the position of where the Pikmin is on you. Okay. So if it's at like a lower position, you can down air and you're like your kick will connect to it. But if it's like on your back or on, on like around your head, you're just gonna go straight down. Man, oh, the upper was so close, but the forward tilt is gonna do it. Nitro with the reset. Okay. Well. Nitro with the reset means we're gonna have at least three more games. Good stuff to Nitro, and now I'm hit in the loser's bracket. We'll see how the second set of Grand Finals will start. Yeah, I want to see if I'm hit actually going to go back to bringing out the wolf, or is he just going to stay with Olimar? Uh, it's, it's, it's tough. Maybe not go to college. I want to see what happens if you ban college. I mean, they could be two other stages that that are even worse than Colin. Maybe, yeah. I mean, okay, Battlefield, yes. Oh, okay, never mind. <laughs> <laughs> At least we're not starting on Colin, right? Battle. Right. <laughs> okay, so I'm hip already locking in Olimar. Huh. Fully confident that uh, Olimar is the correct pick. Yeah, I mean, I feel like all the games, like, honestly, he could go either way, honestly, like, the wolf has shown to work out and not work out, and all of mine has shown to work out and not work out. So. True. I definitely think at this point it depend it's like stage dependent. Like for sure stage dependent. And just like who he's just feeling more conf uh, confident with. Well, Fight gets erased that time, not even ticking maybe even once, not knife twice. Really good stuff on Nitro. Getting getting those white pigments off, killing those white pigments off. It's so, so important. Two reds, man. You can see that as well. Two red pigments. I'm surprised that uh, I'm here as an heritage. Uh, just really sacrificing one just so we can get a different, a different type of pigment in the lineup. Yeah, usually like white and purple are usually like just stronger because they're, I guess, like lopsided in design. You know what I mean? Yeah, also the trajectory of their throw is a little bit different. Yeah. Yeah, the white pigment throw is so far. It's like across the whole Ooh. Okay. Well, I mean, good thing he didn't do that last game. Last game. Because. Yeah. <laughs> completely different. Uh, different type of risk reward in the last game. Yeah, but I mean, probably just an input error. And I don't think it's that bad starting off. Like, game one, you know, getting those input errors, get them out of the way, you know. But nonetheless, Nitro is still in this. I'm taking like 61%, not 2B. Gets the, wow, that killed. That's still, wow. That wasn't even like a tipper, yeah. Wow. Okay. 
I feel like that was like even the, a good thing to do right there. He just rolled and he still got covered. Man, it's such a big hit. Yeah, yeah, it covers so much area and all of them are being so light. I guess it doesn't even matter if you get the sweet spot or not. And this is where what you're talking about, Battlefield, man. Oh, you're trying to maneuver through these platforms? Hell, say hello to my up tilt and up air. And then if you're playing against someone who has like a more uh, direct approach, you can just straight up stand underneath the platform like this and check, check items, check all the items. Wait, oh yes, you trying to trying to come above? Nah, I got up tilt. Wait, you trying to go on the side? I got that F tilt. Wow, up smash even connects to the top platform while you're standing? Yeah, this, this, this stage was made for Belmont. <laughs> The castle, huh? Yeah. <laughs> this is the castle that Dracula gave me. <laughs> like, go away. <laughs> Here's Battlefield. <laughs> Just please, leave me alone. <laughs> Down tilt. Man, Nitro has brought this game all the way back, even with that SD. And is there a worse stage than Kalos? I, I think we might have found it. I had suspected as much. <laughs> but an upman will reach the, that, that first set of platforms for Olimar. Ooh, and that forward smash prank, but the purple Pikmin with that hit stun able to knock him out of that charging animation. Woo, but that back air almost killed cross stage. You know, that this aggressive recovery from Nitro is he continues to throw out aerials, even though he's the one that's on the platform, or on the ledge. Wow. Extends the jump just to stop the momentum. Oh, is that what you're actually like that? Okay. No, can't expend anything from that one to save you. You're just dead. Gets the white pigment latched on. Ooh, and the worst thing is when you get a white pigment latched on you and then they hit you. Because the whole time you're in hit stun, that white pigment is just ticking away. Usually you will see I can go for grabs in that situation. Yes. Just because then he can pummel and then uh, do the throw animation and it just feels like forever. Yeah, and, and by by the time you're done getting out of hit stun, like the white pigment's done its job. Like, it just gets off you and it's like, all right, well, I'm going to go for round two. You better watch out. <laughs> I'll be back. <laughs> All right, forward tilt here. And looks like I'm Hip has a pretty solid lead here. But we've seen Nitro make many comebacks, especially when he just get, pins someone to the ledge and gets all these traps. But pop in right over that F tilt with the purple back air to answer that as well. All right, so game one going to I'm Hip. So maybe I, I, I still say ban Kalos. Like, don't give Nitro that stage. He has. At least tonight, from what I've seen, a ridiculously high win rate on that stage. Yeah. Yeah. I'm trying to think of the other stages you would ban. They're probably banning Yoshis. They're probably doing, like, Yoshi Battlefield or something like that. But, like, I honestly feel like it's harder to set up the uh, Holy Water lead trap with Yoshi's Yoshi uh, Brawl anyway. Yoshi Brawl. Because of the, the, the slant. Yeah, yeah. The, the ridiculous slant at the end. So you can set it up, but it's like, man, can you even set it up? It, it's got to be at least harder slash different. Yeah, okay, well, for sure it's not it's not Town and City. It's not Pokemon Stadium. Or not okay. Final Destination. Yeah, oh, yeah, I'm trying to figure this out, man. Why why do you allow this man to go to Kalos? Well, I mean, he, he must have banned it just now. But we're not on Kalos. All right, well, I'm glad somebody is adjusting. Kalos, Yoshi's <laughs> Brawl? What you guys we don't, I don't, yeah, Lila's not legal. Oh, there's the roll, but he got it in time. See, it, look, it looks like if you roll quick enough, you can't get F-Smash the lead. Like, you can probably still get F-Tilted, but, like, that's not as bad as you have That's true. And I, I think the reason that the, that the Belmonts don't uh, opt to get the Pikmin off them, because even the moves like Nair, that they have that wood, right, like, to sort of like shrug off the Pikmin. It doesn't do enough damage to actually kill them. Yeah. What a call off from Nitro, the up smash. Getting the tip on that. Getting a high recovery in. Here comes the white Pikmin taking away. Look at that damage, man. 134%. Yeah. Good amount of damage for high hit, but at the same time, he's kind of getting stuck in these ledge traps again. But the platform is going to relieve the pressure here. Gets another white ticked on, and Nitro gonna slay it but still 151 percent now and at this point like almost anything will kill like even just like a board air 
from like any pick. Oh, but dead? No, I'm able to make it back on stage. All right. Just continuing to add, rack up this damage against the down smash. It almost looked like he wasn't going to take this off. Yeah, it definitely looked a little on the weaker side. But since he like rolled her spot dodge, I'm hip actually like ran through him and down smash him. Like, dang. Ooh, oh wow, Bear. To just interrupt the, the wall projectiles that Nacho's throwing out. Yeah, that was really good stuff. And like he even like just barely maneuvered around that axe. And that axe is just so much damage to finger for so long. Oh, going up and over everything, and he lands in the clear here. I'm hip still has an opportunity to rack up more damage, possibly. I like the down throw on the platform. It didn't actually send him anywhere until he, he did the second half. Oh, he still had an active hitbox. And you see again, I'm hip is opting to not pull more Pikmin. Didn't matter, but again, like I said, there, there's certain situations where I'm hip just wants to just have the move. Yeah, because he wants to be able to box. He wants to be able to swing. Yeah. Get that young kill at around the 100% mark. Now more Pikmin gets the down air. What's the follow-up? Nothing, but Nitro able to land on the platform, but gets swatted right back out. A deep work. Ooh, wow, the Phantom. The was, yeah, Ape really putting him in a good position there. Oh, man, and now I'm hip. So much to deal with. Oh, man, he's sitting at 193%. Ridiculously high for Belmont to be at. Oh, tried to parry, but that multi hit coming out from the holy water. No bueno, and man, look at this Belmont. Look at this Richter, 200%. But man, it just continues to add up for I'm in. Already taking him at 90%, 103%. You know that. What? Uh, is that not smash? Okay. Man, yeah, it's just, it's just, okay. Blue up throw, definitely gonna take it here. But already 103% on this Olimar. Okay. Yeah, looking for the holy, holy water trap. Oh man, you had to sacrifice the purple. The purple took the hit, dude. That's just a good soldier. I got you, fam. <laughs> Get down, Mr. President. <laughs> oh, wait a minute. Oh man, I'm just trying to make the great return. The great journey back home. He finally finds himself back off stage, but Nitro swats him right back out. Get on this ledge. His head tilt face perfectly. Oh, He's eating up. I'm hit shield. So many Pikmin were sacrificed just to get back on stage. But also, you know, it bracked up Nitro to 89%. Yeah, he got the max rage. Purple's hit very, very hard. I think just has to continue to make it back on stage here. Ooh, can't watch those high recoveries. Oh, See him. back throw? Yeah. No? Yeah, oh, that was close. That was close. Yeah, it was close. That right animation is pretty cool. He just like Richter. Yeah. Yeah, Richter's like fourth throw and back throw is pretty hype. <laughs> All right, so one, one, a piece here. Grand final set number two. That's Nitro right. was able to get that reset coming from losers. Uh, and I, surprisingly enough, I'm Hip was the one they faced off in winners' finals. I'm Hip was the one who ended up victorious there, three-one. That's right. And then Nitro came in, losers from the you know, one losers' finals against Slayers, came back, got that rematch versus uh, I'm Hip, went to game five and was able to take it. Now we're sitting here, grand finals, both players in the losers' bracket. Whoever wins this set is the victor of Wednesday Night Fight. That's right. Whoever it's going to be is going to have to take two more games at least. Yep. Yeah, take two games. Ooh, good combo. Whoa! Do you have your jump, sir? No, I'm hit flying in. Lands with the deep for air. Wait a minute. Okay, okay. Yeah, it's going to drop. Drop an up E. I'm hit still applying all this pressure. Already taking the percent right back. Ooh, doesn't commit for the, uh, the second down tilt there. Might have gotten killed, honestly. Oh, and there's that cross. So clutch, and I can just hop it right over and just let it cross and roll right through. Oh, wow, what a call out. Falling up there into that up match. Just in case he jumps. And yeah, pretty much called out that jump. Yeah, big brain coming out from Nitro because uh, when, when players 
specifically in this game, are getting pressure from underneath, they tend to jump. It tends to be like the, the, that is the safe option. option. Yeah, the safe option. But not when you have a huge up smash. Not when you got enough smash that reaches the top of the battlefield. Or like top, like top, top platform. <laughs> not top of battlefield castle. <laughs> <laughs> Imagine that. Oh, man. I'd just be like up throw, up smash, up smash, up smash. I'm gonna eventually hit, and you're gonna die. <laughs> Dude, that's like the ultimate dude. That's like, <laughs> that's the up smash to the sky, dude. So, I'm hit again. The deficit is kind of bringing it back here versus Nitro. And we see Nitro living to ridiculously high percents. I feel like this is a very common occurrence here in this matchup. No forward smash. No, where was the forward smash? Yeah, I, I, he was stuck in hit stun, like in the multi hit of the, the fire. Oh, another Pikmin sacrificing himself to get nailed by that axe. All Somebody's got to take a hit. Yeah. This time the blue pick and take the hit. The purple keeping that. Oh, and the purple back here. And the reason why that lined up is because down smash uses the next two on your line. So we actually lined that up really, really well. Great setup. Now he's trying to cross up, recover high, but that big up smash from Nitro will close out the stock. Man, you know like when the pick and die like little ghosts. <laughs> I low key feel bad. They scream too. They make a regular little. Oh, okay. <laughs> Screams of agony. <laughs> Help me! <laughs> oh, wait. Gets in there on the high recovery. Oh, wow. Tries to go for that forest smash, but I'm hit. Jumping right on over. Tries to get the snipe with the purple, but Nitro saving that jump away to the very last second. Gets the dive kick and follows up with a forward air. Now throwing out projectiles, swats him away with another forward air. Wow! He fell right into that axe. Yeah, the, the axe is down under, and, and like it, it's just so scary because you don't want to drift away. You want to get close to that stage. And that, that's the scary part about all these setups. And there's the axe anti-air sending them straight up. Two stock coming out from Nitro this game. Number three. Okay. We have another kick for Oops. from I'm hip. But you have to think like, okay, it's now two one Nitro's favor. Is it? Is it time to put on the chain? Is, the wolf, is, it, is it coming out of the wolf then? Yeah. Stop. You gonna Stop. bark at the moon? What's, what's Stop. going on? Stop. Thinking. Oh, you're going back. Down in the city. Okay, so that's kind of interesting. Um, I think that's like an all of our city. Stop. Oh no, 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 it's a wolf city. Well, I was thinking that it was interesting because this is one of Nitro's like counterfeits that he goes to. Yeah, he usually a lot tries of room. to. Uh, it gives him a lot of room, and he's really good at uh, covering the platforms with his axes, along with the, the Holy Cross. I mean, now that he has wolf, he's got the reflector. So like, okay, you got all the room you want, but I can out project out. You know? So now I'm hit, can play the uh, you come to me game because I got reflectors, you throw projectiles, I reflect them. If not, I can throw my own projectile, I'll pressure you there. And of course, you can just always run right over the axe, run under the axe. Yep, definitely. Um, axe is good in terms of anti air, and the angle is like really complicated. Wow, oh, man. Wow, what a start for Nitro, and he just turned it up right there. We're still off stage, and now Nitro's setting up stop, getting everything ready, and this guy did not hit him. Huh. He didn't, but. Uh, <laughs> oh, he's dropping down, so yeah. that's going to be it. Oh, but he dropped down too low. That's so unfortunate from I'm hip. When the head guard is too low, man. And, oh, you already know Nitro's. Uh, he's not popping off, but, like, he definitely took that to the bank. Dude, that's, that's, you have those in, those internal thoughts. Those internal thoughts, you definitely take those. Oh, we yeah. take those to the bank. Yeah. Now a Nitro up, an entire stock. Not down too much damage. I'm him opening up pretty strong here, but down about 40%. But offstage with no double jump, tries to get the axe, but I'm hit with an upbeat to the left. You see that. Those setups coming out from Nitro. He continues to use the holy water. Even recatching the holy water. Now he's going to throw it straight up. It's going to delay. What? Okay. Break it all. Yeah. And man, Nitro's so good at, like, oh, you want to jump out of shield, so I'm going to, like, back here but angle it up. Harry into up B. I think too is Nitro is doing such a great job. Like, oh, and there's the force match. That is gonna seal it out. Nitro is gonna be your Wednesday night fights champion. Good stuff. Right.
not only did he close that, was able to reset Grand Finals Game 5, but then he won the second set 3-1. Good stuff yeah. to Nitro. Yeah, I mean, really, I don't think we saw any Sonic. He usually has the Sonic on deck for certain matchups.